My name's Christopher, and this is my amazing co-star, Max. Gotta face the other way, buddy, but... Hey everybody, welcome back to Simply CB. My name's Christopher, and in this video, we're gonna talk about what Max has been up to in the quarantine. The other day, he got a hold of this glove, actually swallowed it, and then shortly after, he swallowed about 10 pairs of these gloves. No! Like I said, he likes gloves. You're, this is not food. We're gonna talk about what we did after he swallowed the glove and how we saved ourselves from having to go to the vet and spend thousands of dollars cutting it out. A couple days ago, I let Max out into the front yard to play with his best friend, Sadie. They were running around for a while when I heard my brother start yelling, Hey Max, let it go, buddy! It didn't sound right, so I ran out there. Because they were chasing Max around the front yard. Right as I got to him, they said, Oh no, he ate it. As soon as they showed me the other pair, I, I immediately was like, Oh, that's not good. We're going to have to cut it out of him. This is going to be bad. So we looked it up online and found out how much peroxide it takes to make your dog throw up. Max certainly didn't like it, but I think it may have saved his life. Good boy, stay. Ready? Hydrogen peroxide. We use one teaspoon for every 10 pounds. Max is about 60 pounds, so we use six teaspoons or three tablespoons. Come on. Gotta take a little more, buddy. Sorry. Swallow, swallow, swallow. I felt really bad giving it to him. Come on, Max. You gotta throw up, buddy. Come on. He looks like he doesn't feel good. Go. Oh, beast on our hands. Caught and tamed from the wild. What will he do next? What will he eat next? Let me get some blood. Oh, no. He said he's. Uh, I'll feed him again because he's throwing up all his food. He's all tied up. Can I help you, kind sir? Chloe. You're not feeling this. But I can't. Oh, ew, oh, oh, oh. That's another glove, huh? I wasn't watching that. I was watching Look at him. Her. I just asked my mom if she wants her glove back. After Max threw up, we realized that there was actually two gloves. This is the actual glove he ate. You can still see those little holes in it from where he was chewing it before we swallowed it. In my line of work, I have to constantly wear rubber gloves. I put rubber gloves in my pocket all the time. Plus, I've been bringing some home since this whole coronavirus thing. And I have this bag right here that when I empty out my pockets, I put the gloves in the bag and I set them out in our shed. And I always shut the shed. That way, Max can't get in there. Well, the other day I came home from work for something. I grabbed it and I left and I didn't lock the shed like I thought I did. The next day, I see outside that Max had went to the bathroom and a glove came out. And I was thinking, oh, that's weird. I wonder how he got a glove. And then next time we went to the bathroom, another glove, and another glove. And finally he was in the front yard, and I saw him trying to go to the bathroom, and I saw a glove hanging from his butt. And he was trying to go in there and pull it out with his mouth. So I ran over there, I grabbed him by the harness, and I had to rip it from his rump. <laughs> <laughs> and I continued to see gloves inside of his poop. A few days later, when I was trying to figure out how on earth would he get this many gloves, I mean, one here or there is understandable, but how would he have access to that many? And I went inside the shed, and I found this bag empty. I've since filled it back up, but it was on the ground with a bunch of little holes in it and scratches, and this is about how many gloves he ate out of there, which is insane. That's like 10 pairs of gloves. Anyways, it's extremely stressful. Max absolutely loves rubber gloves and anything else he's not supposed to eat. So if you have a dog that's constantly eating stuff and chewing stuff that you don't want him to, it's always best to double check before you let him out to play that there's nothing out there. The one problem I'm having now is that he's constantly digging up cat poop. It's disgusting. I have to go around with the little poo poo scraper thing and I gotta look for little piles and clean it up because he likes to find it like buried treasure. He runs over there and he eats it as fast as he can and it's absolutely disgusting. Hey everybody, hope you guys enjoyed that video. We had a lot of fun making it. Well, not necessarily. We had a lot of stress making it. That's the video we hope we never had to make, but it happened, so we're gonna talk about it and hopefully it can help you guys. Max is gonna try to stop eating bad food, aren't you, Max? You gonna try? 
I'll keep on feeding him um, celery because he likes celery. I fed him some watermelon earlier. Look, it's on his nose. He had a lot of, he really enjoyed it. <laughs> so if you want to see more cute videos of Max and Chloe, of course, check out our TikTok. We're always posting new videos of funny, silly stuff. Cuteness is sort of Max's expertise. You can also check out our website if you want to learn more about our super salmon oil soft shoes that we sell on Amazon. They vastly improve your dog's skin, helps build strong joints, boosts the overall immune system, reduces excess shedding and dry itchy skin, reduces inflammation which helps with pain, it helps with increased joint flexibility and improved mobility. So check it out on Amazon, you guys won't be disappointed. I'm going to put a link down in the description below. And I saw him trying to go to the bathroom and I saw a glove hanging from his butt and without gloves on I had to rip it from his bum hole <laughs> Should I say bum hole? <laughs> and I had to rip it from his rump and I had to pull it out of his cornhole I had to pull it out of his nona circle <laughs> It's a circle sk no, 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 that's not what she meant. Stay, stay. Mix, 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 Okay, 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 mix. let me put you down. Hold on, I'll put you down. Just don't play. I don't want you to get hurt. <laughs> I'm trying to put you down. Calm Jeez down. Louise. Oh, tricks on you. I had it the whole time. Oh. Good boy. <laughs> yes, you're going to try to pet your belly. Oh, yeah. You like my pet your belly? <sighs> Technical difficulties on it's set. Hey, come here, relax. Hey, it's okay, it's okay. Pickle baby. Good boy. Hey, Max, let it go, buddy.